Welcome friends, today we are learning about sequences. The quickest way to retrieve data from a table is to have a column in the table whose data uniquely identifies a row. To achieve this, a constraint is attached to a specific column in the table that ensures that the column is never left empty and that the data values in the column are unique. Oracle provides an object is called a sequence that can generate numeric values. The value generated can have a maximum of 38 digits. A sequence can be defined to 1. Generate numbers in ascending or descending order. 2. Provide intervals between numbers. 3. Catching of sequence numbers in memory etc. Here the creating of sequences the minimum information required for generating number using a sequence is the starting number, the maximum number that can be generated by a sequence, the increment value of for generating next number. Here is the syntax of sequences is given create sequence that is keyword, sequence name that is sequence name, increment by, start with, max value, no max value, mean value, no mean value, cycle, no cycle cache, order, no order, Th these all are keywords that are used in sequence. Some of them is optional, some of them are optional. Here keywords and parameters are given that are used in sequence. First increment by, it will specify the interval between sequence numbers it can be any positive or negative value but not zero. If this close is omitted, the default value is one. Mean value. This specifies the sequence minimum value. No mean value. This specifies a minimum value of one for an ascending sequence and minus 10 raised to 26 for descending sequence max value specifies the maximum value that a sequence can generate no max value specifies a maximum of 10 raised to 27 for an ascending sequence or minus 1 for descending sequence this is the default close start with specifies the first sequence number to be generated cycle specifies that the sequence continues to generate repeat values after reaching either is maximum value. No cycle specifies that a sequence cannot generate more values after reaching the maximum value. Cache specifies how many values of a sequence Oracle pre-allocates and keeps in memory for faster access. No cache specifies that values of a sequence are not pre-allocated. Now let's take an example of a sequence. First of all we create a sequence. For that create sequence. This is sequence name. Increment by 1. Start with 1. Mean value 1. Max value double nine double nine cycle is given here the message will be displayed as a sequence is created to generate the number of sequence we should execute this query select sequence name that is order underscore sequence dot next well that is the keyword to generate the next value from dual here dual table is used here one is in display that is generated by a sequence if you want to next value then simply put slash then two put slash then three in this order double nine double nine is the bound of this sequence that means it is the last number that the sequence will generate. Because of the cycle keyword, the sequence is completed once, it will be started with 1 by again. 
if you want to see the current value of the sequence you should execute this query dual is also used here here the current value of the sequence is 3 because we have generated the last number of sequence is 3 thank you